Tonight, dangerous temperatures are scorching much of the western U.S. with more than 31 million Americans from California to Texas under excessive heat warnings and advisories. So for how long it will last, let's bring in CBS Bay Area meteorologist Paul Hagan. Good evening, Paul. Nora, good evening. The big story is a phrase that we have used several times already, and that is heat dome. It's how we refer to a strong area of high pressure in the upper levels of the atmosphere. What that means is there is literally more atmosphere camped out over the southwestern United States, and the weight of this mountain of air exerts higher pressure. It compresses the air at ground level, and that heats up that air. It heats it up significantly, which is why tomorrow is going to be another day of record high temperatures. Talking about 112 degrees in Phoenix, 111 degrees in Las Vegas. Those are just some of the hottest temperatures, but the 90s and 100s are going to be widespread, which is why tomorrow is another day with widespread excessive heat warnings and heat advisories over the southwestern United States. Now, these heat domes tend to be very persistent, lasting for days or even for weeks. And look at the 10-day temperature outlook for Las Vegas. The heat subsides just a bit over the weekend, but it's still going to be hot. And then the extreme heat returns again next week as the heat dome rebuilds. And if it seems early in the season, Nora, for this kind of extreme heat, it is. Two weeks from tomorrow is the first day of summer. Wow. Paul Hagan, thank you.